Hi, everybody. My name is Aaron Solomon, and welcome back to Legal Briefs. We are very lucky to have Andy Prince with us today. Andy, welcome to the show. Thank you for having me. So, Andy, I know that you've got a really critically important piece of advice for everybody listening. And for some people, it's going to sound, at first, a little bit counterintuitive. What do you want everybody on this show to know? The number one thing that I would tell everybody out there who either owns an automobile and a motorcycle is please, please, please don't cheap out on your insurance. If I had a dollar for every time a client came into my office and said to me, Mr. Prince, don't worry, I got full coverage, I would be a billionaire. Um, most, mostly all of you do not have full coverage. What you have is the ability when your car or motorcycle is damaged to get it fixed. That you did. You got collision coverage, but you did not get sufficient coverage to pay for yourself in case you're damaged, in case you're hurt, in case something, God forbid, happens in which you are seriously injured. You do not have full coverage to protect you from that. The bottom line is, is that you're bombarded every day with ads from the insurance industry. Um, every one of them from Geico to Allstate to Progressive to State Farm, they're all telling you one thing now, and that is please call us and we'll save you money. You're not saving money. It's a lie. It's a big lie. It's a fraud. You're not saving anything. All you're doing is buying less coverage. At the end of the day, when you're hurt by somebody who caused an accident, that person either has no insurance 15% of the time in the state of New Jersey. 25% of the time, they have the minimum coverage allowed by law, which is $15,000. So if you're hurt by that person, 40% of the time, they're going to have $15,000 or less to pay you for your injuries. And we're again, we're not talking about the damage to your car or motorcycle. We're talking about the damage to you, $15,000. So what can you do? In that particular case, if the person only has fifteen thousand dollars or less of insurance, don't think they have a house or assets or boats or cars that you're going to be able to collect from. They don't. So what do you do? You need to maximize your own insurance. And it's not that much more money. But the insurance industry doesn't want you to buy big insurance policies because the bigger your insurance policy, guess what? When you're hurt, that's the bigger payout that they have to make. On your auto and motorcycle policy, there is a provision called uninsured and underinsurance coverage, UM, UIM. If you don't know what that means, you need to look for it. It's right underneath the line for liability, which is what you're willing to pay out in case you hurt somebody else. Most motorcycle policies will only go up to $250,000. Progressive lately, is offering a $500,000 policy. And trust me, it's not that much more than the $250,000 on the motorcycle policy. Nearly all of my motorcycle clients do not maintain $250,000 worth of UM, UIM coverage. They have, you, all of you seem to have bought into this cheaping out on your policies and having $15,000. A lot of you have $100,000. In this day and age with hospital bills and medical bills, it's not enough, it's not enough money. On your auto policies, you can go up to $500,000. So you need to look at that. You need to maximize that. You need to determine, obviously, what you can afford. But I'm telling you, you can't afford it. It's, it's, it's cheaper coverage than you believe. It's less than a dollar a day, probably, to go up to the maximum amount on your motorcycle and your auto policy. And let me give you just a quick example. So if you're hurt and somebody has a $15,000 policy, and you're on your motorcycle, let's say, and you broke your leg, you have a $250,000 policy. They'll pay you the $15,000, but your own motorcycle insurance will then pay an additional up to $235,000 worth of additional coverage. That's the key. It's this UM, UIM, which is everything. It takes me 15 seconds, not 15 minutes, but 15 seconds to save you the opportunity of not having to deal with this disaster. Call me. You can email me. You can fax me. It's free. It's never a charge for a consultation with me. In 15 seconds, I'll tell you whether or not you got really full coverage or not. So that's that's pretty much it. 
Don't see that. That's super important advice. And like you said, it's really the industry perpetrating a fraud, trying to get as many policies as they can. This is great advice and exactly why we're doing the show. I believe everybody needs to hear this. Andy, thanks for joining us. Yeah, I really appreciate you having me. Thanks. Have a good day, everybody. Bye.